Thanks for your patience. A very good morning to our special guests, parents, staff, students and extended school family. It's my privilege to welcome you all to the formal opening of our new practical skills block. I wish to thank the federal government, our college board and the Austin Cove Baptist College community for realizing and effectuating this well needed block under the capital grants program. The new double story block provides us with much needed working and teaching space and facilities in the manual arts and sciences. I would now like to invite Mrs. Dosanos to open the proceedings in prayer. There is a uh, verse in the book of Psalms in the Bible that says it's a good thing to give thanks to the Lord. And it reminds us of how loving and faithful God is to us every day. At Austin Cove, we have a lot to be grateful for. So I would like to ask you to join me in thanking God for his goodness to us with this new building and the many other blessings that he's given us. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you for your loving kindness to us. We thank you, thank you that you have continually blessed us with your provision. Thank you for this new building added to our other facilities. And thank you for the resources that you have provided and will continue to provide for us. Father, we ask you to constantly remind us of your blessings so that we don't become ungrateful. And Lord, we also ask that this new building will continually remind us of your greatness and your provision for us. Bless all of those who have had a part of making this school a reality. <clears throat> Bless all of those who attend this school and work here. And may it always be a place that glorifies you and remembers how great you are. Thank you for each person here and thank you for this ceremony to open the new building and celebrate your goodness. Amen. I would like to invite Mr. Mike Smith, Chairman of our Board, to address the assembly. It's the first time I've uh, spoken in this room, and it's the uh, only one that's been created earlier this year, which, which is great. So, distinguished guests, parents, staff, students, friends of the school, we, it's a special day, celebration of the opening of this new building. And we thank the Commonwealth Government for um, a grant they've given of $1,050,000, and that was 43% of the cost of the building, thereabouts. So if you have any maths you can work out, I'm not going to tell you how much it costs, you can work that out from doing the math skills you've got. So we thank the Commonwealth Government for their part. We thank Lisa Robert Shaw, who works with the Capital Grants Association as part of ASWA, and they distribute it. They've got to be accountable for the money and get all the things coming through. And it's, it should be working with probably $10 million a year um, through a whole range of schools. And she does that very, very well. She couldn't be here today. She'd send her apologies. You wouldn't believe there's another opening today for another school as well, uh, a building. We thank uh, David Wills and his team for the design and the engineering work for that two-storey building. Park City for Colin Parker and his team for the building, and we appreciate what they've done there. Harvey Shire for all the clearances for the building, for uh, all the facilities we have. They've got to be checked through and make sure they're at an acceptable level, and uh, we thank them for that work they do there. On behalf of the college itself, we had uh, John Smith and Dave Darling work on behalf of the college, linking in with the builder, design, engineering work, and we thank those two men for that. So, um, with the beginning, um, it was already mentioned what, what's there, but we, and the students know they've been using the rooms. So there's two food rooms, there's a furniture design room, and a tech graphics computing room. Upstairs, at the moment, there's two science labs set up and running, two rooms that are large, like general purpose rooms, but they really, as the school grows, they'll be changed into science rooms. Underneath the flooring, all the plumbing and everything's been done. Just uh, when the numbers come, then you change it. And those two general purpose rooms move to other, other rooms that'll come in onto the school as well. 
So for us, uh, we're looking forward to the college growing to a four-streamed high school, two-stream primary. That's the dream, that's the um, plan always for the college here, and that's still to be realised. And today, it's now it's time for the staff and students to continue using the classroom facilities to give the students their best education outcome. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Smith. I would now like to invite Mr. Andrew Hasty, MP Federal Member for Canning, to address the Assembly and then officially open the Practical Skills Block. Well, thanks very much, Mr. Bender, um, staff, school board, students, parents, carers, and ladies and gentlemen, it's a real pleasure to be here. Normally they give you a speech that you read on behalf of the Minister when you're representing the Minister, and I'm not going to do that because they're, frankly, a little dull at times. Um, and I feel like I know Austin Cove well enough that I can just tell you how I feel. My message today is that it takes a lot of hard work to build an institution. A lot of sweat, a lot of tears, a lot of money, a lot of effort, a lot of stewardship. Who's heard of Harvard and Princeton over in the US? Put your hand up. They was, they was started several hundred years ago when settlers moved from England to New England in America. They started out as tiny little church-based organisations. Think about some of the oldest universities and schools in this country. They started very small as well, several hundred, well, 150 years ago or so. And so too, Austin Cove, um, it's not as old as those, but um, like your motto, it's going to endure. And... The task of the government, the federal government, is to provide support to institutions while they're being built. So it's my pleasure here today to be your local MP, but also representing the Minister for Education as we celebrate the opening of the Practical Skills Block. And um, it gives me great pleasure, as I drove over the hill, to see it on the skyline and the new gym going in and seeing this institution being built before our very eyes. So it's great to be here and without further ado, I'm going to pull the curtain and declare the Practical Skills Block open. Thank you, Mr Hasty. That brings our proceedings to a close. Uh, we would like to acknowledge our special guests and parents for joining us this special occasion. So Mr Venter is going to take you on a tour of the new Block 1 Practical Skills Block. So I would like to invite you to follow him out the door. And the students to stay seated, as well as parents, you can also uh, take this opportunity to get out of the door before we start setting the students out too. <laughs>
here we are with Andrew Hasty, MP, and Mr. Steve Lee from the local shire. What do you think of the um, new facilities? Well, it's it's a great building. The practical skills block that we're in. It's nice to see another level go up. It's really well lit, clean, great facilities for, for young people to learn in. Yep, perfect. I have to agree. It's a beautiful building, uh, very nicely finished, and uh, I think it'd be a pleasure to uh, for the kids to be in here. Uh, I wish we had that sort of thing when we were younger. It would have been great. The only, the only risk is you've got such beautiful views that yeah. uh, you might have kids daydreaming like I did during school. Oh, yes. <laughs> Looking out the window at the cows. Um, but look, it's, it's great to be here as part of um, the Commonwealth Government. We, we funded 43% of this and um, I think it's real. one of the primary tasks of government is to help build institutions. And so every time we come back here to Austin Cove, there's something new. It's exciting because uh, we hope this school will last well into the future. Thank you. Yeah. Mm. Thank you, Steve. Yeah. Yeah.